Today marks the start of Series 7. We've decided to go back to our roots on the official servers. And as we all know, this is the hardest, truest version of the game, where anything can happen at any moment. Our goal for the series is to become the dominant force, get as kitted as we can, and build a base that will last. But this is not going to be easy, and we're going to have to deal with all the inevitable challenges that are waiting for us. But as you know, nothing is ever that simple in DayZ. So we're back again, and today we've teamed up with one of our founding members, Angry. If you check the hunting post up here, I'll check the one behind. Yeah. Well, we're definitely not going to need a compass. Let's bounce, Angry. Oh, we've got a hatchet. Nice. Right. Let's get some wood. Start this far off. There you go. Um, have you got any matches or anything? Yeah, I've got some matches. Alright, if you set fire, I'll grab some more firewood. Uh, that's better, I'm back into yellow now. Right, let's go. I'll take you down to the well. Quickly do a house to house search. See if we can get anything decent. Ah, oh, sweet yeah. cooking pot. Beautiful, beautiful. Oh, you found it. Yeah. Right, let's fill up this uh, cooking pot and uh, probably after finishing in the town, head up to Novo, mate. I think that's probably the best option from here. So we spent a bit of time getting our food and water right. And the plan was then to finish up in the town, kind of head north towards Novo, collecting as many supplies and resources as we possibly could. Right, let's go. Let's get out of here. Mm -hmm. But we were about to run into our first major issue. So right now I need um, pretty much any ammunition, 12 gauge or 7.62.39. Uh, so if you come yeah, across... Same. Oh, you need the same as well. Okay, cool. God damn hackers. So we respawn and almost immediately bump into this dude. Yo, yo, how you doing? Hey, man, how you doing? You good? No. You good? Yes, I'm fine. Good, good, good. Yes. Okay. Have fun. Okay. Now this guy looks completely new. We're not going to ruin his day. Yo, Angry, can you hear me? Uh, yeah. Okay, did you yeah. die there as well? Yeah. Did you hear any shots? Um, I didn't hear the shots, but I heard damage being taken. I saw blood. Right, so hackers. Okay, so I didn't hear any shots at all. And I take it, did you die at the same time I did? I died literally sec split seconds after you. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So hackers up that way. That's because we're near Novi. That's where they always uh, operate. Okay, fine. So whereabouts are you now? I'm in Solnitchny again. So we agreed to meet up on the west edge of Cherno a bit later on. Dead folk. Ooh. Oh, shit. There's a dead guy here. He's got plastic explosives on him. angry got word to us he was about 10 minutes away so we went to meet up with him on the coast right mate keep fishing let's get some food in you right in again Fuck. Yeah. nice yep, there cut you go up. cut that one up oh sweet you got another one yeah brilliant there's two more. I'll cut that up. Perfect. It was vitally important that we had enough food for our next journey. 
There you go. So they should have four fillets there. And that will do for the time being. So we decided to head west towards the town of Kamenka in order to cook up our fish before nightfall. So I would say let's use this nearest house here. Yeah. Get this done ASAP. Mm -hmm. There's only one door in and out as well. Okay, let's get the sticks on. I've got a bit of paper somewhere. There we go. Right, let's place this on. One, two. Yeah, dump all yours on. Go. So we should have, by the end of it, four fillets each, yeah? Yep. I've got some chicken as well, which we can divvy out. Brilliant. I'll give you the armband, then I? Yeah. Excellent. And on that note, we both decided that we'd log out for the rest of the evening and we'd hop back on the following morning to pick up where we left off. Um, not sure how many bullets are in it. Two. Okay, someone's growing something here. Oh, got another gun. Oh, I see you. Yeah, on the road, yeah. Yep. Repeat carbine here, two bullets in it. Brilliant. As long as we're full on water all the time, food won't be too much of an issue. Yeah, that's true. Right, you ready to go? Yep. Right, let's get out of here. Head on west. Oh, I've seen some crazy shit out here before. Yeah. Right, the sea's good. So we're just going to now move into the forest. Yeah, now. there you go. There's a tent on the edge already. Uh -huh. For real? Yeah. They put it on the right on the outside on the edge. Which, uh... which means that, as you know, that whatever's in it, if it wasn't recent, would have been spawned. Yeah. So we're going to take this tent. Yeah. Right, so the first thing we're going to do once you're here is we need to search these bushes here. There'll probably be dig sites or shit around. Yep, yeah, look, there's a gone-off mushroom here. Someone's uh, been here recently. Right, you ready? They may even be in here. They're not. Okay, so the tent itself is empty. But we're yep. gonna we're gonna take the tent because we'll use that. Have you got room in your backpack for that? Possibly. Yeah, I can make some room. Give me a sec. That's cool. Let's go down here. While you're doing that, I'll check this around, this area around here. Yeah. Man, I always find stuff down this way. Shut that out. Well, I can't see any dig sites. Uh, I think this area is clean. And when you're ready, angry, we move on. Well, 20 minutes later, and it was time to replenish our fish supply. Yep, got one. Excellent. Come on, third time lucky. Yo, actually got one. Happy days. Got a cooking pot. Lovely. I'll happily take that. Um, Alright, there we go. Hand wash. There we go. You good? Yep. Yeah. Alright, let's go. I'm not getting our shoes wet. 
Having headed inland, just south of Zavir, there's a little settlement we needed to clear. Oh, a crate behind here. Empty crate. Some multi bits. This shed here is normally based up in. Yeah, let someone's loot cycle in here. Oh, yeah. Might be worth you clearing the house. Okay. Coming over now. Okay, you cover front door. I'll head round back. Clear? Yeah. Just need to clear up some space. Yes, yes. Good work. Let's do it. Be careful, don't want to break your legs down here. Okay. Time for some river dredging. This is normally a good spot. Yeah. Around here. So if you take left side, I'll take right side. And all you've got to do is... Have you done this before? you simply um, got to run intriguing. through it and open, jog through it, open up your infantry every two minutes. Just keep clicking the tab menu. And it will open up the infantry. And then you'll see if there's anything underneath. Found some. Found loads of crates here. Uh, there's not, uh, there's not much here though, but we do have one sewing kit. Leather sewing kit. So let me just turn that around. So someone has definitely been using this. That might be a good little stash point for us. To yeah. be fair. Is it good if I take the tactical jacket? I'll take what you want, mate. Yeah. Tactical shell. Take. I'm that. probably going to take the hunters. Yeah. I'll take the tactical shirt because I've got the patrol jacket at the moment, which is basically the worst version of this, I'm presuming. Yeah. Oh, so actually. That, so that's good. We've found a load of crates here. I'm going to quickly go and check a little bit further on. So, do you know what? Now we know that's there, someone is probably put that there with a view to be using it shortly yeah so what I now am going to do and I'm coming back to you I'm going to take my uh, my shit off of there that I've dropped on the ground so we're going to cut that up into rags there we go we're good Anything that you don't need, we're going to chuck into the river. We're just getting up into the trees here. I need to wring out my clothing. Yeah, I'll do the same. Everywhere we'd been so far, we'd come across remnants of bases, of little stashes, tents, but we're still yet to find a live active base. I don't think it'll be long before our luck changes. Where's he going? Oh, he's on you. There's another cooking pot here if you want it in a bit. I'm in the house. First house. Okay. So, first house is clear. I want to do my... Oh, there we go. Oh, cooking pot. Yeah, I've seen that. Yeah. Yeah, so this, is, this has been here a while ago by the looks of it. I'm in the second house. Yep. Yeah. Oh, no, we're clear, mate. We're clear. Could you grab some... Um, some sticks, mate. Which house are we going to cook in? That one you're in now? Yeah. Yeah. Ah. Uh, shit. Yeah. Right, I'm coming in now. Do any nails in this? 
could definitely get nails from here anyway if we need them. Yep. It's me coming on. Yeah, yeah, cool. Just got my cooking pot on the stove here. Okay. Might as well take the shoes off, get them dry. There we go. All yours? Yeah. I've got you covered. Right, let's go. Ready? Be careful, might get sniped on the way out of here. I think we're good. So we've headed over to the Western Mountain Range. And we picked things up just as we were about to make a vital discovery. Right mate, we've hit we've hit mate, I've got shelter. Uh, where? If you go up to where... Oh shit, we've got a couple of shelters here. Where the rocks are... You see the big rocks? Oh, mate, we've hit the fucking jackpot. Wait, come up. Um, you'll see a load of rocks. Uh, yeah, I see some rocks. I'm like near the pub. Uh, okay, are you actually on the pub? Not a moment, but I can get there. Oh, uh, mate, there's another tent here as well. Right, go to... Holy shit. Right, go to the rocks... The big rocks. I'm standing on top of them now, where you can overlook the pub. There's a there's a big set of rocks at the top, right behind the pub, just behind the pub. There's a big set of rocks. Here you go, oh, right, right, yeah. right. Follow me, follow me, follow me. We've hit the jackpot here, mate. Oh, mate. Check this out. You have to come round this. Shit. Yeah, come round here. Come round here. Right. Be careful. But come in here. Check this out. Oh my god. Right, hold on a minute, hold on a minute. Right, I'm going to take the SSG. Um, oh, we're not, we're not even looking at the same shelter, jeez. Yeah, look down, look down. So there's some... The lighter would take that. If you want to take the M16, take the M16. Yeah, that's, they don't have a mag for it though. Need uh, to we. Bison, they've got a bison bit there as well. I've got, got loads bison of agent. ammo for the SSG. We've got some uh, some much needed stuff, so I'm going to get rid of that carbiner now. Oh, I've got a full mag. We've got a full mag with the SSG. Lovely. I've got loads of 762 by 54 as well. Right. Holy shit. That can go there. Quickly load this up. That can go in there. Rope. We'll swap out that rope for their rope. If you want any of that ammo, mate, take it. Might as well take the 74 as a close combat. I'll take the 74. Um, what should I do with that? Matches will hang about. And then when you're ready... I'm trying to find out what I did with that. you got a gun cleaning I've kit? I've got I just took a bunch of 556 out of a mag, but I don't know where it went. Uh, 556, not on the floor, but there's another tent I found down here as well. When you're done, I'll wait here and cover you. You ready? Yeah. You done? Yep. All right, follow me. Right, we're just going to quickly check this bit. There's another tent down here, though. So if you follow me down this way. Yep. I think by the looks of it, this is going to be loaded as well because that they are both loaded. There's a a medium tent down here. I have just seen. Yup, we have crates. Oh my god! Is that you loading your gun there? Yeah, that was me making all that noise. All right. What else we got here? Take one of those Savannah mags. Take gloves. And have a look at what's actually in this tent, if there is anything. Nah, we're empty. 
there may well be more stuff here that we haven't seen. Yeah, for sure. If you take that side, tree-wise, I'll take this side up here. Yeah. Right, I'm just at the hunter stand on the top of the path. I've actually found some uh, some hunter pants, so uh, we're slowly, slowly getting there. I've got a funny feeling this ain't over, mate. So let's keep on searching. Oh, got another tent, another tent. Oh, yeah? Okay, if you, um... Let me just check this out before. Oh, yeah, I see it down there. Okay, in got the a canopy. Yeah, hunters. I've got hunters, uh... Scope. Got some boots. So this will be theirs as well. Looks like this, like this area is going to be, uh... Quite profitable. Yeah. With day two drawing to a close, day three would prove to be our most eventful by far. The hunter's hut here as well. Um, and you want to go to Sinistock Way, don't you? Yeah. Alright. Oh, hold on. Crate. A load of crates. Oh, shit. Look at this. Look Holy. At this. Jesus. God damn. Packs of cases, I'll take them out, see if there's anything in them. I'm gonna take that. Plus a run mag. I'll take the mag. Yeah, there's loads of NBC shit here. I'm gonna yeah. take a hunter's pants, so better than my hiking pants. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Let's take some nades. For sure. You take a couple of nades. You take those two that are left. We'll take the food as well. So those two nades that are left there for you. I'm going to swap my jacket over with their jacket. Yeah. Um, as I think. It's probably going to be best. Oh, that is handy. That is. Right, something. Now, have we got? Here we have. Excellent. That's a good little find, that. Yeah. Very nice. good little find. Right. Brown can come off. That can go on. And on the floor, yeah? Yep. Of course, I'm just going to check the rest of these. Oh, just... Yeah, there was a base. Look, there was a base in that shed. Right, let's go clear it. Still crates in there. Right, let's clear the house first. Okay, house is clear. House is clear. I'll cover you. Love alone nails here. Eh? So we've got three boxes of nails. Lovely. Anything in them? Great spare empty. Yeah, I thought it might be. We decided to make a couple of little stashes for our building gear and nades. Let's do it here. Let's go, man. Let's go. Yep. Get the fuck out of here. With Angry needing to get off for the night, I decided to stay on for a couple of hours and try and get a base down. But with the server at full pop and a queue to get in, we knew we would have to revert to our solo tactics. And things were about to heat up. So we picked things up just west of Radio Zenit at a heli site immediately before it all starts kicking off. 
Right, well, we've been here scouting this place out for a good minute and a half now. We're not far off Glaza Castle. I can't see any movement here. So I'm going to try and uh, get rid of some of these Zeds. Have a quick little look, get in and out. There's been quite a few shots popping off from over near Northwest Vibor and Lopatino Way. And the server right now is full full, so um, we don't want to be drawing obvious unneeded attention to ourselves here. Right, let's see what we actually got here. Do you know what? I've not found any weapons at any heli sites in the last two or three so far. Oh, we'll take the 556. I'll do... Just waiting for a shot to pop off. Take the lockpick. So that's two we have now. See, there's absolutely nothing here. Again. Alright, let's uh, stealthily move out. You're getting one in the back, old son. Alright, I think we're good. We're good. Was that a shot? Just that was a silent shot just literally flew past us. After searching around for a few minutes, we couldn't work out where that shot had come from. So, we headed over to Crescino, where we were about to discover some brand new intel at the church. Well, there's been no noise for a few moments. We're over at Crescino here. Um, it seems pretty quiet, but it's always worth checking the, uh, the highland areas here, including the church, so let's just go and take a little look. Oh, there's a kit down there. Oh, there's a base here. Is that four dials? It's a four dial code. So this is just being built. So there's a barrel, there's a medium tent that's not quite gone up. Now we can get in this. The only problem is, can we get out? Just shut the door up. So it looks like someone's off to try and find some nails. Now if we jump on this uh, beam here, we can probably vault straight over that. Wait till our stamina's all good. And we're going to have to use, unless there's a hatchet in there, we're going to have to probably use an item, place it down to get back out. But it should be doable. Oh shit. There is quite a bit of gear here. Main the NBC stuff. Okay, let's make sure we can definitely get out. Place the tent down. So this base is being built as we speak. There's nails in the walls. And if we get on there... God damn, take the bag off. We get killed like this. Anyway, get on the beam. We should be able to get straight on top of the tent. Pick the bag back up. Come on. Combat backpack's good. Get on the tent, and then we should be able to vault once again back over that. But we do need full stem. Come on now. You good to me? There isn't a hatchet here, so we, there's no other way of getting out. Here we go. There we go. We're good. We're good. Okay, so this is definitely one that we can come back to. And if you look on the floor here, they're trying to build. There's a little fence kit. That'll be a gate. So they're trying to build that up. So we moved on to Nevea Petrovka and we're about to get into it, as you can hear. God damn, this boy's all over us. I couldn't even see him at all. We scouted this entire area out. He's literally just pulled up on us. It's a good job he can't hit his shots. He's only about 200 metres away. Right. Let's pop the epinephrine, and we're going to sprint up the top of this hill, get over the railway line, and then circle round, try and get a good position on this dude. Yeah. He can't hit shit. <laughs> it is quite funny when they do that, man. <laughs> oh, dear. Is he giving up? No more noise. Right, we're going to make it look like we've gone right, but actually we're going left. We're going to circle around a little bit. Okay, so we've um, literally gone about 40 metres to the right. And we're just popping back down now to try and locate this guy. 
And I think he's got a, yeah, he's got a car. Okay, so he's driving his vehicle. He's got himself a little aider. Just popping a shot across his bow so he knows we're here. Reload. Let's try and get a more accurate one. It'll be quite difficult. The range is about 200, 300 meters here. That would have probably hit the vehicle. All right. He's still going. So he's heading back over to Nevea. Here he goes. Now, if this guy's smart, he will probably dump the vehicle in the industrial or somewhere nearby and then try and take a position on us. So we need to clear this entire area. Okay, we've hit the industrial, can't find this dude. But we've now gone up just above the apartments and there's two lorries here. There's a load of Zeds hanging about. Is this a base location for that dude? Maybe it's a team. I'm not quite sure what we're dealing with here yet. So we're going to take a little bit of caution. We're going to go round the outside of the apartments. He may even be in or on the apartments waiting for us. We definitely do not want to go setting off any Zeds right now. Now what are the chances that there's actually an active base somewhere around here and those lorries are actually being used? Maybe they're full. Maybe they've got some gear in. I'm not sure, but there's two of them. So clearly something's been going on here. So far so good. This looks like a proper ambush. Absolute ambush point, this. So we're just making sure that we can't see any obvious signs. We need to get in between the two trucks here. Just see if we can get... Oh, there's a crate on the floor there. Okay, so there is... There's a nade. There's a nade there. So this is being used. Right now, this is being used. Got 308. Picked up a nade. We've got some 9x19. What else we got here? That looks like that's empty. Okay. This is, uh, this is very dodgy, the position we're in right now. I think the best option is to get on top of one of these apartment roofs and have a proper scout of this area. Let's get ourselves sorted out here. We're going to generate a little bit of Z activity there. I think it's only one, but that will quieten down in a second. Hopefully, by setting off that Z, if there is anyone around, it may well pique their interest a little bit. And we're going to go over to the other side of this roof. So, um, so there's a gas cloud. It looks like over Topolinky Way. Hold on. Am I seeing that right? Is that smoke coming from? It's smoke coming from the chimney. That's the car. The dude's in there cooking. Is he for real? It's just been a load of gunfire, and the dude has not even moved to the next town. He's literally bold as brass. Left his car right next to, on the edge of town, right next to a uh, a house, and he's clearly cooking up. I mean. Normally, I would say this has got to be a trap. And fair play to the guy. If he set a trap here and he's in a completely different location waiting for us to roll up on him, then he deserves to win this encounter without a doubt. So let's just see what the hell is going on here. But you never know with Daisy, man. There's some craziness goes on here. I bet he's actually in there. I bet he's in there. Let's have a little look. Is that him? He's at the door. Hold on a minute. That dude's shooting high in the air. He's not even aiming at us, but his shots are coming this way. Please, not another hacker.